the first section of the museum is the uh, pinakabunso po ni Nanolo Lola. So, si Uncle Paul po, we actually share a story together kasi po, I kind of relate to him. Kasi po, si Tatay, after po niya mag-painting habang nagme-merienda, um, so, syempre po, wala pong maiiwan sa studio. Nandun lang po ako, nasa studio, all the art materials are available. Oh, look at that. So what I will do is that I'll get a brush, I'll dab it on the palette, and similarly to my Uncle Paul, I would ruin oh, my tatay's painting. Oh my god! <laughs> As in you painted over it? Yes. <laughs> so, how uh, cute. Similar to that, okay, Lola, we gave it to our own use. Para na lang hindi niya makialaman yeah. ng gamit ng tatay niya. Opo. So si Uncle Paul Red, one of the most admirable things I think about him is that uh, he's the youngest person to have a one-man show at the age of 9 years old. Are you serious? CCC. It's so cute. Opo. CCC. Richard, it reminds me of your drawing. <laughs> Ito yun ang na-exhibit. Sa siya ni Peter Paul. So, I'm not sure po which one. Look how cute. Did he do this? Oh, at age of at age five? Five, five, five. Are you serious? Yes. So probably po hindi pa po yan. Probably much more later since nine years old po si Lolo. Ah, si ano? But si Uncle Lolo. Look, tapuan niya na yung mga ano higante so. Oh, this is awesome. Are this this as well? Yes. Uh, this section. Uh, so this is him as a kid. This was him. Yes. Oh, so cute. Look at that. Come on, this cannot be a by five year old. <laughs> cannot be by five year old. Kung makikita niyo yung mga girly artworks, oh. nila naka-display niyo. Kasi sa ibang mga museum, kung maganda yung nasaka na makikita niyo. You know, I would buy this. If somebody sold this to me now, I would buy it. I mean, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm not, I mean, in terms of, I'm not talking about the style. If I saw a style like this, if, if somebody, you don't tell me that if, no, no, I'm not talking about this specific one. But if, I'm just saying that the style, if somebody sold me a painting that looked like that and didn't tell me it was a five-year-old or a Blanco, I'd say, it's beautiful, I'll buy it. You'll see Justin's feel his. Yes, but that's his. When he was 10 years old. Are you serious? <laughs> God. We travel a lot, more, so we get to have inspiration from different places, such as this, which is the Mayon. This kind of reminds me of your painting. My pagka impressionist na to, it's not so realistic. Here he was 13 years old, and this one 14. Unbelievable! Look at that. Although I also painted my mom at 14. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. So at this section is my tita gay, from the word gay, ti, joy. Um, contrary to most children, si tita gay po, uh, she learned to draw before learning how to write. Oh. <laughs> so most of her works po, uh, consists of watercolors. Pero teka, I just wanted to, this is, this is look what it looked like in the room. Yes, but this is the studio way back then. Look at that. See, look, this is Paul, the smallest. Oh, Paul, that's the Bunso. And the, so the older ones were painting already. Here's your Lolo, and then all the kids painting around. That's it's yeah. my tatay. Oh, oh, oh John. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we all paint together as much as possible. So it's not like early works. See, 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 Yes, well, that's the thing. It's major floor. She loves painting for the relationship between the mother and the child. But you see here, Lemuel, I was asking about styles, Jan. Pero as children, pag hindi ka pa tinuturuan ng, ng technique, kitang kita ang kaibahan. Kaibahan. Oh, so different. Her paintings are so different from Paul's. Kitang, as, as, as a child. Because wala pa yung influenza ng Diba? It's, 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 it's really who they are. From, you know? Yes, it's so apparent. Dito para yung mga mata, buhang I love this one too. It's so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> this is the, the, the dog. 
No, but how interesting because she was probably watching her tatay do all these people in one portrait. Oh, and so yeah. she was sort of replicating it. But look at her style. It's so beautiful. Iba naman, no? Definitely, no, this the shop. They were canvas or wood. Or, 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 uh, so this one was for the teenager na siya, si Gay, no? Ang Moriones mo. Ah, first time. I've always dreamed of coming here. Oh, okay. It's 15. Oh, okay. Carlo, here's a perfect example of what Jan was talking about. How do you make it not like just a photo? It's a composition. It's the elements that you put in there to make a statement of your painting, no? Um, so, natanong po ni uh, Tita Cardo how this was made. Um, usually po kasi, whenever we go out, we always have sketchbooks. Kasi po, um, uh, ang photograph po kasi, it doesn't really capture what, yung pinaka spirit po na of something, the mm. real essence. So through the drawings, we can really capture the spirit and mas maano po, mas mas accurate, mas accurate. And uh, I think it's mostly sketches and uh, uh, memory. Oh yeah. So this is from sketches and memories. So you sketch it, bring it to the studio, and then finish it. Yeah. Then put the different elements together. Oh okay. um, yes. Because usually po, uh, one painting, it's not just one sketch. It's a compilation of yeah, a lot yeah. of sketches. Right, so that's why it's not a photo. It's nice emotion. At saka, if you notice, di ba, dito medyo parang blurred tapos to give focus on the, mm -hmm. on the yeah, subject. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She was 15, Carla, when she did this. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, like, like this one, Carla, when you look at it all, you've got the rice terraces behind you, but she muted it. Diba? She muted it. Saka parang it's, you could tell that uh, the, the sunshine is in the back. Kung ka parang namamahal ng brightness, so you could just it's brighter. Look at the details of her celery. No? 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 Patrick, tingnan mo to. Tingnan mo detail niya to. Holy cow, and even the basket. Fresh na fresh. What was what was gay specialty naman? Um, mother and child. Ah, so madalas. Ito, ito sa yeah. favorite kong gawain. Yeah, okay, okay, so okay, Jan, ito na yun. <laughs> Hindi mo sinabi anong favorite mo kay Paul. Ganda Oh, come on. Look at that. Look at the details of the patadyong. Ganda ng effect. Ang ganda ng effect. So what does Gail do now, aside from painting? She marries, has kids? Uh, concentration on painting. Pa rin painting, pa rin. Sa painting. Basically painting. And where do you sell your paintings, John? Dito pa rin lahat? Or Dito. meron na kayong ibang like, si galleries? Dito pa rin. Dito lahat? Yung pinag-usapan nyo na dito lang magiging available ang mga blanco? Pero dun sa mga, no, mga nagkakakalagos. Exhibit. Oo. Pwede naman lumabas at mag-ano sa ibang gallery. Opo, oh, as opportunities ka. Oo oh, naman. Yeah. Always another mother and child. Ang ganda kasi parang very Filipino yung... So this one is a perfect example, Carl. Hindi to photograph, obviously. Because you can't get all these kids in one picture, right? Yun ang composition na yan. Ang composition. Yun ang one yan. Is it trying to say something? Like parang trying to emulate the Virgin Mary? or? Or a holy image? Or you have enough kids, stop it already. 